Hi guys, welcome back. It is time to do some more chinchilla. This one is... I'm not even sure how to pronounce this. It's one colon five, and I don't know if that's supposed to be like one to five, or... I mean, usually the title is somewhere in the song, so I'll be interested to see how this is actually spoken. If that makes any sense at all. This is Chinchilla. Let's check it out. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. I wish that I could say I can only do with so much rejection But that implies I'm gonna leave and I'm too weak, yeah, I'm too weak now I'm hopelessly addicted to the breadcrumbs of your affection When you send one less kiss than me, it's all I read, it's all I read now I say I love you, but you only reply one out of five times. One out of five, right. Like I love you, but I hate you with such a fucking fine line. <sighs> Are you doing it to spite me? Oh, couldn't you say it a little more? Or do you really only love sometimes at a ratio of one to Is she supposed to be a fly? I don't know how to keep to my own bare minimum boundary. I hope you never see the truth that I would move no more for you. So I cling on to the secret while you dance in circles around me. We both know I will make you choose in case you do, in case I lose now. I say I love you, but you only reply one out of five times Like I love you, but I hate you, it's such a fucking fine line Are you doing it to spite me, oh? Couldn't you say it a little more? Or do you really only love sometimes At a ratio of one to five? Oh my god. The lyrics in this are freaking incredible. Okay, it's one to five, so I get one out of five. Sorry, it's one out of five. That is just a ridiculous way of explaining the need that some people have to constantly feel validated, I guess, by a partner. Personally, I've never understood that, but it is a real thing. Some people do feel like if somebody sends one less kiss than them, then that's all they will read into. Uh, I think it's really important to know who you are communicating with sometimes because some people find these things so important and other people will turn around and go, I did what? What? I, I told you I loved you like three times. Like, how is that not enough? You said it four, you gave me four kisses. Wow, it is such an amazing amazingly written song wow um somebody actually told me an interesting story in the comments this morning actually apparently she really hates i don't think she's terribly comfortable performing and she uses the fingernails and all the sort of decorative makeup and features in this case the big fly mask and everything to in some way kind of mask and um I think people do it to kind of change themselves so it doesn't feel like them performing. Uh, they can kind of step out of themselves a little bit and oh, it just absolutely amazes me that somebody like this that is so talented, who has a voice so beautiful and is a stunning, stunning young lady as well, could be self-conscious and not feel comfortable sharing this ridiculous talent with people. Um, Honestly, I think it makes her more endearing. Um, sometimes, I, I love it when a performer loves being on stage. 
but sometimes if they love themselves too much, it makes me like them less. I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I love this. Let's keep going. I is the person I've been fighting for. Emotionally unavailable. What have we been so divided by? Love me once and love you back five times. So say I, say I, say I, say I, say I love you. So say I, say I, say I, say I, say I love you. So say I, say I, say I, say I, say I love you. Do you really only love sometimes? I love all the throwbacks in her film clips and Ren's film clips. You can see all the people with the white bags over their head and stuff. Very reminiscent of Ren's film clips, especially the ones that he does. Well, more so in Sick Boy and High Ren and all that sort of stuff. But yeah, she always does little clapbacks to those sort of things. Um, I noticed in Fingers at the end she had the chalk outline, which bugged me so much that I didn't point out in my last video but anyway that happens sometimes I have often wondered if I should like you know you see people put in little like later edits of them editing only most of the time when I'm editing I look like absolute crap and I do all the film myself but often it really really bugs me when I don't say something that I really wanted to say and sometimes I think maybe I should just edit it in and anyway let me know if you think that that's something that I should do. <laughs> I'm so unsure of myself sometimes. But, Chinchilla, what is to be unsure about? She's incredible. Absolutely ridiculous. Her struggling with this idea that this person is just emotionally unavailable. But, I don't know, my interpretation of it is actually that these feelings are overly needy. I don't know. I don't think somebody should have to tell you five times that they love you, whether you tell them once or five times. But everyone feels differently about these things. I don't think anyone wants to feel like somebody loves them five times less than they love their partner. And I think that's what the juxt of this is. I don't know. For me, it comes across very needy. But it is incredible writing. I do love it. Lots of people are going to relate to it. And, yeah, absolutely love it. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. If you haven't left any suggestions, please let me know. What's your favourite band? What's your favourite song? See if you can shock me and come up with something that I've never seen before. I really, really appreciate it when people do that. So, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet, and I hope to see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye.